It has been an incredible honour and privilege to serve Ontarians as their Premier. The impending departure of Premier McGuinty shuffles up a full deck of rumoured potential replacements. Kathleen Wynne, George Smitherman, Glenn Murray, Deb Matthews, Gerard Kennedy, Dwight Duncan, Michael Bryant, Chris Bentley, just some of the names tossed into the hat of speculation. It's a well-experienced crowd. Smitherman, for instance, was a major Liberal player. He's been out of the game for a couple years now, but he's still pretty popular with Party Faithful and not directly saying no. Focused on uh, raising my family and growing my businesses, and um, that's uh, that's the only considerations that I've really had. And today, the finance minister has been one of McGinty's top guys for years. He's the deputy premier right now. I honestly, I have not given it a lot of thought up until now. I was I was as surprised as everybody yesterday. So that's a big decision. What's so that's, that's, not, so that's not a no, that's not a no. I mean, it's not a no, that's correct. You'll get the same response from Kathleen Wynne, one of the more well-known MPPs, a former education minister, but will she try for more? It's too soon to commit. Uh, lots, of, uh, lots of decisions to be made. Liberal sources tell Global News that in Cabinet today, the Premier told ministers that anyone who runs for his spot has to step down from their Cabinet post. That'll likely whittle down the field a bit. All that aside, the party has other concerns. For one, how long this next phase will last. This could be a brief term for the next Premier. I think that leader will meet the House uh, for a fairly short period of time, probably bring down a budget, uh, really an election budget, and then go to the polls. This right after leadership hopefuls go through the ordeal of assembling teams, raising funds, and slugging it out in public in the race to replace McGuinty. Could that leave the war chest bare? This Liberal strategist doesn't seem so worried. The Ontario Liberal Party is in pretty good shape compared to the other parties. We're fortunate that we've got uh, the funds. Um, both the other parties are in some debt. However this unfolds, it'll be several months still before we get a glimpse of the new look Liberals. Mark Carcassol, Global News.